checking your phone a little bit. How, how is it right now? Oh, I just turned it off. I want to make sure I you know, wasn't buzzing or anything. I want to be focused. Yeah, I didn't even look at it, to be honest with you. Nate, when were you told you were going to get the call, and what was this week like in preparation, given it was a short week between games? Um, Sunday. I knew Sunday, you know. Um, short week of preparation. You know, I just do my job, you know. Coaches got me ready. Coach Nitty, whole offensive staff got me ready. I, I felt confident for this game. Who's the news to MVP walking down the steps? Well, I mean, have you gotten that a lot in the locker room tonight? Um, <laughs> yes, yeah, definitely. Um, you know, they, they may say that, but I, I relied on those guys so much tonight. Um, offensive line played absolutely fantastic. Rodney had a great game. Um, obviously sealed it at the end with a, a long run. Um, I was really excited by him watching him run that in. Um, you know, defense stepped up, absolutely. Um, you know, big stops there to the end of the game. So, I mean, uh, they're calling the MVP, but I, I definitely <laughs> relied on them a lot. I'm sure you've been waiting a long time for this opportunity, and you've seen two guys at your position get the opportunity before you. How nice is it to get this chance this year, you know, on a team that you've been around on longer than anyone else at your position? Yeah, I'm just so grateful for the opportunity. Um, I came to Pitt. I love Pitt, and I'm, I'm just, uh, it was just, uh, I really enjoyed getting on the field. How different was this week and tonight uh, compared to Western Michigan and the lead up to that game and then playing? <coughs> it seems like there was a different approach. Um, you know, short week, like y'all said, um, but, you know, we just, we study our opponent and we, uh, we get prepared, and that's what happened uh, for Boston College. You seem pretty composed back there tonight. Um, how were you able to step in on a short week, take over the starting quarterback position? You know, it's, it's my job. It doesn't matter if I'm third, fourth, fifth string um, to be ready to go in the game. And, um, you know, all season I made sure I was prepared um, for this moment. And so when my number was called, I would be ready. Touchdown pass to Bub. You, you had a pump fake that led, that led to him to get open. Was that part of the plan the whole way was to get a certain look you guys were practicing for? Yeah, that's what I was talking about. You know, rely on other people. Offensive line blocked great there. Um, I pump faked it, saw the, I think, uh, you know, the hook backer, I don't know. I think they might have messed up the coverage there that dropped into that first window um, for Bub. Pump faked it, and I knew I could get him behind, so I ended up throwing it. Any touchdown pass or touchdown run? Which was, which was your favorite? Oh, pass, no doubt. You know, I, I love spreading the ball as the receivers. You know, it, it was a lot of fun. Can you take us through that run? Go ahead. Can you take us through that run? Go um, yeah, no, I just saw the uh, DN squeeze, knew I had an opportunity, uh, pulled it. Um, saw the first defender cut in and, and jumped over the guy for the end zone. It was <laughs> it was pretty awesome, you know, get a get a touchdown. Nate, I know after your uh, first win, your head coach posted a picture of you playing piano in the hotel lobby. Was there any uh, pregame concert this time around? Yes, there was. Yeah, there's a piano on the third floor of our uh, of our hotel, so I went up there and played it last night. What'd you play? Um, oh, Idea Ten. Um, yeah, that's what I played. Yeah. <laughs> Now you had around a 58% completion rate, opposed to your other quarterbacks, that is a phenomenal rate. How are you going to work to improve your game moving forward? You know, uh, you know, there's definitely a lot to improve. Um, you know, even on the field, um, some of those incompletions I knew right away I should have gone somewhere else. Um, you know, I, there's a lot to improve always, and so I'm excited to get an opportunity next week to uh, to show that. Hey, who delivered the news to you on Sunday that you were going to start? Uh, Coach uh, Signetti did. How did Christian kind of handle this week in helping you get ready for this game? Uh, he's been phenomenal. Um, you know, that whole room, just a bunch of team players. Um, we're all there for each other. I, I love those guys. And uh, he was nothing but helpful this week. And I, I couldn't, you know, be happier with the way he treated me. Anything final? Grenades? Was there any, were there any tips that uh, Phil gave you guys on uh, what to expect with Boston College? <laughs> uh, not really. I mean, we, we went in and, and got prepared. I mean, we knew what they were going to do.